Good evening. Uh, welcome to the ICA for this, the launch of the IPA's latest uh, behavioral economics publication, Behavioral Economics in Action. Uh, five years in the making. Um, yeah, five years, well, didn't take quite that long to write, although it felt like that on days. But uh, what the publication does is it reviews case studies from the IPA Effectiveness Awards, which have made use of behavioral economics since uh, the behavioral economics agenda was launched when Rory Sutherland was president. And all the time we were doing that agenda, people would ask, where are the examples from our industry? And finally, we have them. So uh, it's brilliant to bring them together. The publication is, uh, is at the moment is a PDF only, but if there's enough demand, it will become an exciting old-fashioned print edition. Uh, so please ask for that, because I'd like one to give to my grandmother. Uh, <laughs> but um, the, so it'll be available from the IPA's website as of now, I think, or certainly first thing tomorrow. So you'll be able to download and read that publication. But tonight, uh, we're going to be talking about some of the ideas in there. So in a moment, I'll welcome Rory Sutherland up to the stage to... Uh, so I'd like to say how he feels about things five years on. I'll then briefly talk to you about the five areas, five areas of best practice which are discussed in the publication. We'll then be joined by um, Susan Paul and Don Boyd, who both have uh, case studies which are highlighted in the book. There are 15 case studies highlighted in the publication. Uh, and they will talk a little bit about their experience. And then, uh, because I know this is the bit people always love, we will throw it open to a Q&A. 